Sorry, Herr Adokmus, wir haben es mal wieder total verbockt. Ja? Ihre Profikanzlei von nebenan, wir haben es mal wieder total verbockt. Aber hey, bloß weil wir es zehn Jahre gelernt haben, heißt es das nicht, dass wir es können müssen. Ne? Aber ja, so viel dazu. Uh, let's switch to the English section of this fucking video. Like, how about you tell us why it took you fucking three days to record another video? The uh, last recording was on Thursday. Was a. Uh, uh, what was it? Uh, I have to turn on the printer, printer scanner thingy. It's cold as fuck in here. So you get like uh, this warming bottle, bottle of, uh, I don't know, uh, hot water inside. It's quite uh, warming, comfy as fuck. But uh, yeah, on Friday, I had like a lot of coffee, a little bit of sleep, and I got my new laptop, and uh, a lot of cool shit was happening. But not so cool that I didn't crash afterwards. And with crash, I mean crash of exhaustion. And when I say crash of exhaustion, I really mean, I really mean fucking exhaustion. This wasn't nice, man. This wasn't really nice at all. So uh, there was this shit going on, like uh, school, you know. The best school is the school where you have to like wake up at 6 a.m., take a fucking shot at 7. Uh, Drive to Munich from Karsing to Munich, one and a half hours from eight o'clock. Then you arrive at 10, 10 a.m. Then your then your tummy makes a little bit rumbly sound. That's when you know you gotta take a shit. This is always the fucking case every fucking Friday, man. And then uh, what was the other thing? Yeah, uh, like one and a half hours schooling, you know. And then like two buddies uh, in the class said, hey, how about we get a burger? Said, uh, yeah, sure, why not? And we drove to this greasy burger stand thingy. And this was actually quite a nice burger. But ordering this shit was kind of weak, y'all. And this fatty, fatty burger made me really tired. As always, when I was driving back. Oh, fucking dust everywhere in this bitch so yeah that was the first thing the fatty burger let's check this off the script that i'm definitely not reading because i'm fucking improvising man okay yeah oh nice because i don't have any internet i can't access the fucking google docs but here's the thing though i just checked the fucking mark that says offline i just work with this document offline so there's no problem there's no fucking problem in that right but uh, here is the thing. I write one single fucking letter or I open the document and it jumps right back to online. You can only work with this when it's online. Uh, so I got my PC right here. I have a LAN cable right there, but I could try to use my smartphone for writing, but I'm using this one for recording right now. So that is out of the way as well. The fucking heater ain't working. Don't know what's up with that like the two uh, states in this room is freezing your ass to death like seriously I don't know can you see it in the light my nipples are fucking hard man yeah here you can see the bulge my nipples are like you could cut glass with them okay that's the first thing I have to scan like 200 documents uh, transfer that shit into an email and send it tomorrow then uh, What's the next thing? Yeah, I got a new laptop. Really nice thingy going on there. Like, it took me half an hour to set up because it was so fucking fast. 16 gigabytes of DDR4 RAM, uh, 2400 hertz, you know, the casual DDR4 rate. And fast as fuck, y'all. And the only one is now getting, I'm setting this shit up for uh, crypto mining, but not like AS, ASIC. Uh, uh, and minor level 10 uh, loud fuckers uh, which destroy your hearing now nah, this is like uh, special mining for uh, shitty coins that only give you a profit uh, because I don't have to pay uh, for the what is it the current the bill for the you know electric electricity bill you know that's uh, why this is falling away and uh, yeah, that is what is 
on the agenda here. I got my beer. I got like I have to clean this other window. I cleaned one window, but it gets so fatty. This was like a blue cleaner and a yellow one, and I combined them and turned green. You know, I'm a color expert, and I cleaned, uh, cleaned, 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 cleaned Eastwood. I cleaned this one. I have to clean the other one, and uh, there's so much grease and dust on there. You wouldn't believe it. And uh, yeah, that is uh, going on. I also wanted to split this video into th three videos, but I kinda gonna make it with the time schedule if I just keep up. Yeah, uh, then dead battery. Yeah, I had to buy for this old guy some food and some beer and whatnot. And uh, what was it? What was it? Yeah, the car battery died from one instant to another. Like on Thursday last week, like four or five days ago, I just drove with the car. And uh, on Saturday, I wanted to drive with it as well, and uh, the battery just died. You know, like, this really happens, man. I never experienced this before. So tomorrow, the plan is kind of that we switch the fucking battery. Yeah, that was happening. Then uh, I got this buddy, and he helped me moving from one place to another, but it was kind of unorganized. And since then, he, like, uh, once a month... Months, once a month, he mentioned like, yeah, I never help you again. Fuck you, man. I fucking hate you. And when I brought up the topic with moving, there are like two uh, states right now. Either he gets aggressive as fuck, like screaming, like, yeah, you fucking retail man, get your fucking shit together. This is like the one uh, state, mental state. And the other one is like uh, overhearing, overhearing what I said because uh, I think deep down that this is because this guy might never move and this is like compensating you know it's like a big thing i don't know this was also what i was writing down because seriously man it really bugs me like just say in my face i'm retarded man just accept me for that and say okay dude i can respect that i'm also retarded but oh uh, yeah then the oven i kind of recorded the oven with a field recording sound you know when the wind pushes through and the flames get higher and bigger and whatnot this is what i did then uh, i <laughs> you can't see it maybe right now oh, fuck man let's let's see if i can can you see it now nah, uh this is like this is a orb out of um material like uh wind protection you know like some some foam yeah it's foam and it was a sphere but I held the fucking field recorder against the oven and like <laughs> the fucking orb melted man and like <laughs> and I have this custom design custom design orb recording field recorder thing maybe I can sell it for a uh, collector's value purpose and whatnot yeah <laughs> <laughs> a little bit of ear rave here and there what was the other thing uh, yeah the oven thing and the denison I wanted to read or write about that. A denison, that is like the shit, you know, when you drink coffee, that's the shit that keeps you going, man. But at like two, three, four hours, I'd say, and the adenosin takes the other side, the other way. I have to look at this fucking camera. I kind of get confused, you know. I see the buttons, my eyes focus on the fucking, you know, stop button and the filter button and whatnot, and the pause button. But I should focus on the camera. There you are. Oh, hi. There you are. How lovely to see you finally. I love interacting with my crowd, you know. And uh, <laughs> what was I saying? Yeah, uh, the anas uh, denison. Uh, anison. Medicine. The anesthetics. The denison um, is responsible for uh, exhaustion, you know. This feeling of, uh, yeah, when you're really exhausted, uh, fatigue. And uh, this shit, man, this is like the worst nightmare. And the only thing to fix this is like drinking a little bit less coffee and getting a good night's sleep. So uh, you always have to consider this with every with every cup of coffee you take, you know. There's always this downside, man. You know, I have to kind of watch my adenosin levels in the future. But on the other hand, caffeine is the only thing that keeps me going. This is my god. If, uh, if there is any gun I believe in, I'd say it's caffeine. Uh, this is the only friend I ever had that never let me down. Yeah, then triangles. 
Cold. Yeah, 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 yeah. I had the fucking idea about um. I watched the Pollock movie. Yeah, uh, two thousand appeared. You know, released two thousand with uh, Ed Harris as director and uh, the main actor portraying Pollock and how he came to his art style and whatnot and how he's a tortured soul because he is an alcoholic. But uh, yeah, it de kind of depicts everything wrong in a slow tone. This isn't one of the biggest Ed Harris's uh, masterpieces, I'd say. If I'd stalked the guy, I'd probably find a better movie. Yeah, and uh, I thought about stupid designs and like, there's a lot of stupid shit out there, but nobody ever thought about the idea of um, releasing. Follow me, you know, uh, walk with me, walk with me. <laughs> uh, fuck man, I got something in my eye, maybe I should poke it and itch a little bit more so you can turn red uh yeah i thought about like <laughs> try triangle screens man for, for for pc maybe even for mac who knows you know <laughs> and uh <laughs> this isn't seriously man a triangle a fucking triangle and uh it's not like it's uh the, the graphics card recognizes the shit you're doing you know when you plug in the triangle monitor, the graphics card won't say, ah, oh, this is a triangle monitor, so you can only place desktop symbols in this area. Nah, this is like a main monitor, but the shit gets cut off, so it treats it like a square monitor. You have like parts of your, what is it, star tray, and you have parts of your desktop symbol, if you can find them. <laughs> and this would be great. And the other thing would be like, not just triangle, but also for certain customers, uh, circle monitors, you know, like, <laughs> imagine that shit, you know, <laughs> this would drive everyone wild, yeah, and this is what, like, <laughs> went through my head the last two or three days, now, um, a buddy of mine had, like, certain, what is it, like, tests to do, and next week, next weekend, I'm all by myself, oh, Self, you know, and uh, I got some eBay sales to do, and maybe even some music. But Lord, behold, you know, maybe I even make it to open a new project or finish an old one. But Lord Almighty, stranger things might have happened. But, uh, yeah, that is all so far for now. I got my beer, I got the documents to scan, I opened the fucking program. Um, later on I jerk off to some anime titties probably and uh, yeah then it'll be uh, 12 p.m. or 00 a.m. I don't know midnight Monday Monday midnight not Tuesday midnight Sunday to Monday you know then I should go to bed and I got a lot of writing to do I wrote a lot of other shit like 500, nah, 200 words I'm missing, three, 300 words I'm missing in one essay, and 1,700 essays I'm missing on the other side, and the caffeine went out. The plan was to get a lot of caffeine, you know, kind of convert the caffeine into words. This partially works here and there, but other shit happened, like I couldn't get one single fucking word out of my, out of my head and uh, into my hands. And this is usually an easy process since I'm like uh, not filtering high quality content. I'm like, come on, keep that shit coming, keep it flowing, you know. Everything is better than nothing, really everything. And this is a good concept in a lot of aspects. Yeah, and this Pollock movie kind of inspired me if I can like get, I don't know, some painting shit together like acrylic uh, colors and uh, canvases and whatnot and I got some and I paint some shit and I'll like a pretentious uh, faggy little dude I'm gonna hang the shit of my own drawings here and there uh, interspersed with uh, official artist things and I tell you what Really nobody, really nobody will recognize who is who, you know. There might be like some art students who have studied that shit for like five to ten years, but a lot of people won't recognize Jack shit. And they'd say, oh, who's this painter? And I'd say, yeah, I, I farted on the canvas. Not to put any, anybody down, which, which I'm kind of doing actually right now, but it's just a very pretentious art form. It's better than photography, but 
photography because um photography is just uh capturing the moment where you're standing you saw some shit so you take a photograph but uh, the next step is like editing pictures you know like making blurry or very unique you uh you make a picture okay then you take a certain object you keep the contrast the color contrast the uh, contrast of this one object preferable red or yellow or blue even green might work and the other shit is like grayscale black and white really man this is deep stuff but the next level would be like painting and the next one would be movies and uh, music movies and music are like the higher uh, so it might sound like a fucking read but i don't care man uh, it's just not just because the effort is effort is kind of higher but also it's less pretentious it's more like either you got a good movie or got good or you got a good song or you don't you know and you have skills or you don't while in photography there's the most pretentiousness and in drawing there's a certain skill level but it's between drawing you know paintings are the perfect uh shadow realm <laughs> it's called a shadow realm jimbo uh between uh photography and music and films you know it's like schizophrenic uh, subject i'd say yeah nice i almost got 70 minutes and i'd say that is enough so see you next time guys bye